This pandemic has really changed everything. But not for us! We built a big dome over the f***ing mansion! What happens when 800 of the world's most elite footballers and their managers live together under one roof? Players stop being polite and start getting real. This is The Champions. They say form is temporary and class is permanent. I hope they're right, because my form has been not good. Sometimes I like to pretend I'm a Cinderella. Hey, it fits! Terrible things are happening in Barcelona right now. Oh, you hate to see it. Me? I love to see it. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I hope this message finds you well. Just a gentle reminder that I still exist and would like a job. Yeah, so far life in the dome is pretty good. Every day us cool young bros make crazy pool parties. The Farmers League is teaching us to grow our own food. And anything else we need is delivered by drone. Oh no, my scrunchies were in there. Our toothpaste. Ah, oh, my brass knuckles polish. Whoa, whoa, what's the problem, lads? Allow me to interpret. Our delivery box has crashed into the cornfield. Now we are all without our luxury items, and as a direct result, people are losing their shit! A high stakes rescue mission? That's OFT, opportunity for TikTok. Come on, bro, you are always on TikTok, because I'm the king of TikTok. Ugh. Woo! Don't worry, guys. The champions will handle this. Ice, fight, drive. Let's do this for Canada. I mean Drake. I mean hey, Germany. Hey, don't forget your fifth wheel, my dudes. It's not that we don't like Lewandowski. I mean, on the pitch, he's amazing. But off the pitch, can't he just hang out with players his own age? Isn't this so lit? Just a bunch of cool young dudes having a cornfield and chill? Hey, guys, what am I? What am I? I'm a pole dance. <gasps> <laughs> you get it? Pole dance. Because I'm Polish. Yeah, we get it! Yo, trill out, man. Okay, everybody, calm down. You calm down. Both of you Alfonso's need to back off right now. Uh, hey guys, I think I found the box. Oh shit, we did it! Come on guys, let's celebrate with a TikTok! What's up y'all? We just did a search and rescue for this delivery box because if you want a job done, you send in the champion. Hey, 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 we fuck, fuck, fuck. We will never die! What is wrong with you? Yo, my phone won't turn on. Mine either. Sacre bleu! How are we to get home without our phones? What is your deal, dumb cop? Why would you blast us with champagne? Why did you even come along? It's time to face the facts. I may be only 32 years young, but I am also 32 years old. Sorry, guys. I now realize I was being mad extra. From now on, I'll just be normal Robert. Let's get you boys home. Ah, yes, that is poop. Oh, look, we made it. Or rather, I finished for you guys. Whoa, you did it. How did you know how to do all that stuff? This is how we got around in my day, before smartphones and Fitbits. <gasps> the ancient times. Man, old people are cool. For once, we agree. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Seriously, we've been gone 90 minutes. What happens when 800 of the world's most elite footballers and their managers live together under one roof? Players stop being polite and start getting real. This is the champion. I'm so excited to make a big difference at Bayern. Maybe this season we can beat Barca 9-2. 
It took a bribery scandal to get Harry Maguire on the front page. Me, all it took was a haircut. I never cheated on my Italian citizenship test. Are you reading that off of paper? No. That's a bit odd. Everyone's been curious about my incredible man management of Christian Pulisic. Well, I kind of told him a lie. As a form of motivation. <laughs> but no, I'm definitely manipulating him. Okay, okay. I told Christian if he played really well this season, I could maybe get him a job in the Queen's Secret Service. What? Why would you do this? <clears throat> Beg your pardon. Forgot to knock. Being a secret agent is totally awesome. I get to do one-liners and climb around in the air vents. Plus, Chelsea has so much money to burn, they bought me like all these cool new gadgets. Uh. All right, lads, everybody on the coast. Uh, Spot, take the mask off. Off me. Stop what did it. you do with Frank? Stop it. <laughs> Oh, that is you. Hey, Frank. I fear Christian's taking the spy bit a bit too far. If I'm to get him back on side, I'll have to call in the big guns. Hello, Jose. No, sorry, no time to talk right now. Um, may I have Slotan's number, please? Yeah, boy. Pulisic. Christian Pulisic. Huh? Zlatan? <gasps> Ibrahimovic! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Zlatan, I got your note about the secret mission. Shh, be cool, be cool. Okay, here is the stupid backstory. Someone is kidnapping footballers and turning them into human trophies. <gasps> Oh my god! There he is! Grab him! I have said too much! Run! Ah. Hey, leave him alone! We were in the middle of a conversation! Ooh, <laughs> fresh meat! How about a taste of this Hershey chocolate? <laughs> Don't bother following us, Christian! You'll never find us at our evil lair located on Roman Abramovich's yacht, which is the only boat in the harbor a hundred meters that way! Dang it! They got away! Gosh, now I'll never find their evil lair. Hmm, where could it possibly be? <laughs> the boat! They're on the boat, man. <gasps> I bet they're on the boat. Oh, wow, the Zlatan statue. They must have fixed it. Nose is a little small, though. No, I've been turned into a trophy, you idiot. Shh, trophies don't talk. <laughs> Congratulations, ding dong. You found me. Sergio Ramos? Who else? No, seriously, who else would be the bad guy? I'm gonna stop you. Well, you can either stop me or save your friends. Please save us. Yes, we are so scared. The choice is yours, Mr. Pulisic. <laughs> hmm, my friends or Sergio Ramos? My friends or Sergio Ramos? My friend. Bro, you can do both. Just get a move on. Right. Hang in there, chaps. I'll get you down. Wait. Oh. Gee, thanks, Christian. You saved us. Hasta la vista, baby. Your Majesty? Oh, gods, save me, Mr. Pulisic. Let the Queen go, Sergio Ramos. All right, all right, I'm going. Jeez, what an overreaction, this guy. Oh, thank you, Agent 10. You really gave it 110%. Terrific, a proper spy job, but that must have been very stressful and overwhelming, hmm? Enough to make you never want to be a spy again? 
Are you kidding? I'm just getting started. Come on, give me another mission. Give me another mission. Anything, anything. I now realize my lie has sent Christian down a dangerous path of self-delusion. Well, there's only one way to sort this. With an even bigger lie. All right, one more mission. I need you to go undercover as a Chelsea footballer. So deep undercover that you'll never speak of being a spy ever again. Ever. Got it? Oh, that is so smart. I mean, I don't get it at all, but it sounds really smart. There must have been an easier way to do this. Last one, the training's a rotten egg. <laughs> Hope there's no lasers in there. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Please, Christian. <laughs> Don't worry. That's all behind me. I'm just a regular old football player guy now. Splendid. Good show, Agent Polisic. You've made Britain proud. And Frank doesn't suspect a thing. And he never will. What happens when 800 of the world's most elite footballers and their managers live together under one roof? Players stop being polite and start getting real. This is the champions. People say all I do is score penalties, but I also dive to win those penalties. Oh yeah, first American to wear a Barca jersey, America. You think it's so easy for Bayern to win the league? It takes a lot of careful planning to buy all the best players from all the other teams. When the weather gets colder, it's a good time to reconsider Florida. We've got loads of hot spots. Hurry up, mate. The ladies will be here any minute. And the last we brought you some lunch. <gasps> what are you doing? Relax, bro. We're digging a contraband tunnel. Jaden. If you want to play for Manchester United one day, you can't be breaking the rules all willy-nilly. That's how you end up slipping. Slip on this. Who does this thing? That's it. You need to learn some respect. Right now, you have it pretty good at the mansion, but you never know what next season brings. Time you see how the other half lives on a tour of Europa House. No, I can't go back. You can't make me. Hello? Anyone in? Here's body. I do not sneak up on people like that. Welcome to Europa House. Sorry about the exploding light bulbs. They're incandescent. As a former juvenile delinquent, I've developed a process for getting through to young players and setting them straight. I just scare the shit out of them. Right this way, up and coming talents. Let me be your ghoulish guide through this house of mare. We start every day here with a free breakfast buffet. Oh, that's not so bad. But it's also not so good because there's no eggs. <gasps> Where do we get the protein? Here we have our all-inclusive community fitness center. Oh, nice. But it's just one elliptical. Oh, that's not how you're supposed to use that. Want to take a dip on our Stadio Olimpico-sized swimming pool? Well, too bad because there's no towels. Oh, oh no, they're cold. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> what happened to those guys? Oh, nothing. That's just their away kits. I was trying to show you how small the rooms is. <laughs> I don't like it here. It's scary. What's scary? This guy. The scariest thing about him is his caffeine addiction. <laughs> I'm sorry. You think I'm funny? I'm funny how? I mean, funny like a clown? I'm not a clown. This guy's a clown. I do birthday parties, bar and bat mitzvahs, quinceaneras, and I've even done some football games. Look, mate, you can't scare me, so stop trying. It's just embarrassing. Oh, you don't think I'm scary? All right, then. I'll show you something scary. What is this place? It's a sauna, but it never gets hot. Go ahead, take a look-see. Yes. 
Fuck me! What was that? Anyone fancy a loan to less? You know what? Oh, oh, hell no. I'm no, out. No, I must no, not. No, no, no thank you. Behold, my envelope of doom shall reveal your fate. Ah, Phil Foden, hope of England, like so many talents before you, till a little injury will become a persistent one, and before you know it, your contract is up for renegotiation, and you find yourself smiling through the pain as you hold up a West Ham shot. No, I don't like people blowing bubbles at me. Ansu Fati, they call you the next Messi, boss. Like Bojan before you, it all goes wrong. You ask for more playing time, but instead you're sold to a Portuguese club with a buyback clause like I got never brought back! Yeah. Uh, okay, Brendan, I think that's enough. They're just young lads. And you! Jaden Sancho. Your fortune is just three letters long. M. L. I said that's enough. No, 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 mommy, please. Phew, thanks, mate. You really showed me I need to shape up, so I don't end up like you. Ah, another successful role modeling by Jamie Vardy. Bon voyage, lads. Don't forget to write to your new mentor, Jamie Vardy. I'll come closer if you want for me ankle bracelet. What happens when 800 of the world's most elite footballers and their managers live together under one roof? Players stop being polite and start getting real. This is the champions. Things are really crazy at Barcelona right now, but I'm not one to panic. Hey, did you call me? Every team needs an identity. Mine is Premier League. Where are they now? <laughs> People keep saying my problem is that I overthink things, but have they considered that they're not thinking about things enough? Mm. England is so different from Germany, but at least the food is still bad. Come on, microchip. I know you're in there somewhere. Ever since leaving Liverpool, people act like I just walked off the edge of the flat earth. <laughs> but I am still the best defender of the truth. You see that? The dome is fake. It's a projection created by Bill Gates to control us. Exhibit A. Yahoo! <laughs> oh, what is this? They smell like a Dutch meadow full of tulips. Oh, yeah. Oh. Virgil? You're supposed to be injured. Oh, this is impossible. Can I help you, Dacian? Oh, uh, so sorry. I was uh, looking for Mo Salah. I miss him so bad. Cool. Anyways, good luck with that. Hey, uh, you were running pretty fast in there, huh? I guess. I mean, I'm just rehabbing. And you didn't even break a sweat. <laughs> I never do. He can't be human. He sprints with a bad ACL, doesn't sweat, and still smells like a springtime in Holland? There's something stinky going on, and I'm gonna stick my nose in it. Clones. 
You shouldn't be here, Dejan. You were transferred. You guys! You're not gonna believe it! Virgil van Dyke is a clone, and there's a whole army of clones in a secret Liverpool laboratory! A laboratory? Or is it like a Labrapool? Oh, come on, guys. This is just another one of his cuckoo wacky do theories. It's true. I can prove it. It's always something with this guy. First, he said there's a secret fight club in the basement. Then Garrett Bell's an alien. And now this. You're a liar and nobody believes you. And even if we did believe you, nobody has a VHS player. He has a point. Right on point, Martin. Right? Yes, yes. Who has time Very to right. rewind yes. things these days? Sorry, Dejan, but maybe it's time to find a new hobby. And a new hat. If I want to convince these guys, I will need some hard evidence. This will do. That doesn't, that doesn't belong, belong to you, Dejan. Get back! I'll expose you! I'll tell the whole world what you're doing here! You, you shouldn't have said that. that. Now, now we, we can't, can't let you leave. leave. Flank him. You'll never walk alone. You'll never walk alone. You'll never walk alone. Wait, I didn't mean it. I saw nothing. Come on, who am I gonna You'll tell? Nobody believes alone. me anyway, right? <laughs> okay, okay, I'll never stick my nose where it doesn't belong again. Please, alone. I didn't mean it! You'll never no! Oh, the mm. eggs here are so good. Mm. Hello, comrades. It's me, Dejan Lovren, the Zen at St. Petersburg center back number six. After a good night's sleep, I now realize there's no such thing as clones. Anyways, enjoy your day. Uh, did anyone else know this Lovren has no belly button? Yeah, he's a weirdo. Cleaning up after everyone is exhausting. I really need a holiday. When booking my trip, I sometimes wonder, what else could possibly go wrong? I mean, that probably won't happen. But if my plans have to change, it doesn't matter. Because Hotels.com has flexible booking options. Hotels.com. Because just in case. What happens when 800 of the world's most elite footballers and their managers live together under one roof? Players stop being polite and start getting real. This is the champions. Watch out! Santa Claus is coming to town. I like my candy cane. Harry. Hmm. I suppose I should ask Santa for a real passport. What gift can you give a man who has it all? Uh... Humility? Oh, how much is that? I'll buy 100 humility. Shoot, shoot, get out of here, Europa House urchin. Ugh. Ooh. Oh. I love Cristiano, miss. It's a time to put aside our differences and receive expensive gifts. Oh, what is this? It's a squishy trophy. Is it, uh, is it supposed to smell like this? All right, all right. This one is for you, Robert. Oh, cool, my dudes. You should not have. <laughs> oh, wow, it's so big. <laughs> it must be a, a... A Ballon d'Or? But we figured you deserved it this year anyway. And... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Who are you to just give someone the Ballon d'Or? I mean, he was the top scorer in the Bundesliga and the Champions League this year, and Bayern won the treble, so... Oh, okay, well, if we're all just giving the awards to our teammates, uh, Ronaldo for uh, having the most Instagram followers. You get the Ballon d'Or. Here. No, Messi gets the Ballon d'Or for putting out Bartomeu. Uh, uh, give me that. Give uh, uh, well, if we're giving out the Ballon d'Or, I want the Leviathan Award for Best Goalkeeper. Oh, like you would win. I want a Grammy. I want a Nobel Peace Prize, man. Let's oh, go the trophy. It belongs to Ronaldo. Here is how we will settle this. We will all get dressed up and gather in the auditorium. And I will host this year's Ballon d'Or. It will be a very tasteful ceremony, as long as everybody follows my rules. Okay? Here 
are the rules. Nine men enter, one man leaves. Begin! Slap! Slap! Who run faster now? Wait, I don't get it. What are the teams? I am very confused. Should half of us take our shirt off or something? Why did you call it beyond Ballandome when all the important stuff happens inside the Ballandome? Yeah, I guess I got carried away with all the cool costumes and production design and didn't really think the rest of this concept true. Okay, okay, new rules. How about this? Four men enter, two men leave. Those men advance to the knockout round. We do this eight times. Then we take those 16 men and put their names in a pot. Hey, look, it's snowing. Whoa, snowflakes. Oh, it makes me so happy. I love the snow. It's a white Christmas. Oh. Oh, I hate to be the interpreter of bad news, but that is just asbestos from the roof. Oh, man. Oh, not snow. Oh, dang it. Guys, what are we doing? It's Christmas. We shouldn't be fighting over some award. We should be coming together. Kevin. Kevin's right. Robert, if anyone deserves the Ballon d'Or, it's you, man. You earned it. Thank you, guys. That means a lot. And while I 100% deserve the award, 2020 has been hard on everybody. So how about this year we all share the Ballon d'Or? break after being stuck here forever doing other people's laundry. When booking my trip, I sometimes wonder what else could possibly go wrong? I mean, that probably won't happen. But if my plans have to change, it doesn't matter. Because Hotels.com has flexible booking options. Hotels.com. Because just in case... Nom, 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 nom. For more corny videos, like and subscribe to BR Football. If only I had teeth. <laughs>